from Target Field in Minneapolis. MLB the show has interleague action for you this afternoon. So Leading just about off, the set. Here's the veteran Bill second Walker. baseman, Colton the Wong. Baseman. Colton. The pitch. Off the mark there. And that's how we get started here in Minnesota. Next offering misses. And now 2-0. When you get ahead in the count, there's no doubt that the success rate goes up. And that's what he's been doing. It's made a big impact for him in recent games. The wind of the pitch. And he walked him. Leading off the afternoon for Milwaukee. The Tyrone Taylor Tyrone will Tyrone hit next. Taylor. First nope. offering misses the mark. And the pitch. And there's a foul ball. And a pitch. And that one is lifted in the air. Kepler coming in on it. No trouble here. Picks it away for the out. And there's one down. And now it's Christian Yelich. What a season it's been for him. He has supplied a lot of power and that average. Pitch misses inside, and that is ball one. And the right-hander deals. That one missed. Wong stands at first with one out. The next offering misses, and that's ball three. Righty delivers, and a four-pitch walk. So here we go again with the walks. It's been a real struggle finding the zone for him in the past. Now, even if they get out of this jam, these walks add pressure and stress to the entire team. Now it's Hunter Renfro, and that one fouled off. The pitch. And he gets that fastball by him upstairs. Don't play situation here. He's been working up in the zone. Typically, you look for guys to get that ground ball. See if he adjusts on this next pitch. Next one off the plate inside. Now one and two. And the righty deals. And a foul ball. He stays alive. Runners at first and second with one gone. Next offering is downstairs. Well, Boog, early on in this one, having a hard time getting settled in. He's not showing control to throw strikes, and let alone to throw it where he wants in the strike zone. This could be a tough one for him. And a swing and a miss. Down on strikes, two out. So first and second with two outs. And now here's the veteran DH, Giancarlo Stanton. Blasted a solo homer yesterday. The only run they were able to score. In there for strike one. Two outs. Chopped to third. Urshela picks it up. Tosses across the first. And that'll do it. Bottom of the first. This is Dylan Carlson. The center fielder. The wind and the pitch. Carlson. Top of the zone for a called strike. Swings and misses. Oh, and two down. Then he really sells the changeup with that arm action. Lifted in the air, out to left. Yelich should have this one. Calls it in, and there's one away. Nice warm Thanks. day here. Good baseball weather. Baseman. Does that change anything, Chris, especially for the hitters? Absolutely. You feel so much more comfortable at the plate. You're not worried about you know, getting jammed on fastballs inside part of the plate. Uh, you can kind of be more selective instead of just looking out away so that you can get the barrel to it in that part. You can get on the inside part of the plate as well. The 2-0 is in for a strike. The fastball at the bottom of the zone can be very effective. Just got to keep it on the corners. 
Next pitch is in the dirt. Three and one now. Good plate appearance there. Able to take the walk. Well, he tried to nibble right there and just missed his spot. Hitter didn't offer at it. Now he has somebody to worry about over at first. Gio Urshela to the plate. And that's in there for strike one. At the belt and fires. That one is hammered right field. Back there. Pulls it in on the warning track. It's a really good a swing. Goal. He just didn't get quite no, enough of it to beat the wind. It's blowing in from right field right now. No, no. And at first, here's Miguel Sano. First pitch, just misses. In the air, pretty deep out to center field. Taylor moving under it. And the inning is over. In Minnesota, and now the first baseman, Rowdy Telez. First pitch doesn't find the zone. Ball one, no fight. That's a bullet, but it goes foul. So now one and two. The pitch. Swag and a miss. The velocity blasted it right past him. Omar Narvaez at the plate. And first offering is fouled off. Left hand hitter waits. And the pitch is outside. Ball one. Swings and misses. That is strike two. A wide to kick the pitch. Way inside, gets out of the way. And here it comes. Full count, three, two. The 3 2 is off the outside edge, and that is ball four. What a battle. It's not always easy laying off a 3 2 pitch, and I tell you what, he earned that walk. Here's Luis Arias. This one blasted deep to left. Way out of here. Home run. Willie Adamas stands in. In the first pitch misses for ball one. Still only one out here in the inning. Next offering is in for a strike. In there. And so now one and two. And a ball evens the count. One down, base is empty. Swing and a miss. And he's down on strikes. Adamas down on strikes. Colton Wong up to him. Walk to open the ball game. And the first offering is not close. The pitch. And now two and nothing. And that's down it away. The wind of the pitch. That clips a corner. And he deals. That one to first. And foul ball. Looks like you got a little excited on that fastball. Got to think to yourself, you want to stay up the middle. That way, if you're a little bit early, you hit it out of the ballpark. If you're a little late, opposite field knock. Urshela makes the catch, and that'll do it.
Leading Back in target Robert field, Green. bottom of the second. Max the right Kepler field. at the plate. Max Kepler. First Ooh, offering, misses the mark. Well, after putting up a nice inning on offense, got some runs across, this is where you look for the starter to go out there, have a shutdown inning. Don't give that other team any hope. Uh, you just hope that he can get through this inning, get the bats back up there while they're hot. Line to left, and it goes just foul. Two one pitches in there, and the count is even. And the two two. And that's ball four. Leading off for the Twins. Not shortstop. And now it's Wilmer Flores. Flores. Foul ball. Kicks and fires. Here's the pitch. Runner goes. Kicks and deals. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. One down. And now up to hit Miguel Cabrera. In there, and it's 0-1. Kepler, at first, one gone. Next pitch, not close, up high. Tying run at the plate. Late with the swing there. So far, all we've seen in this at bat are fastballs. Look for him to slow it down right here, ahead in the count. This one in the dirt. In there safely. Breaks his bat. There's a soft liner. And they put the tag on him for the out. And now it's the catcher, Gary Sanchez. Sanchez. And it's fouled away. The 0-1. In today's game, you look at exit velocity as a measure of process, and if guys are hitting the ball hard, eventually the results usually follow. Gary Sanchez, he is a guy that hits the ball hard. One, two now. Swing and a miss, and that is that. Back here at the ballpark, top half of the third inning. Up now for Milwaukee, Tyrone Taylor. First offering misses badly for ball one. And a pitch. He needs a quick one, two, three this time around. Last inning threw a lot of pitches. Next pitch misses. Three balls, no strikes. Right-hander kicks, deals. Splits the plate, three and one. The wind of the pitch. That one fouled off. Here comes the pitch. Swing and a high fly ball to left. Joe settles underneath it, and he makes the catch. And there's one away. Just pulled off of it a little bit right there. That front shoulder coming open instead of staying closed. If he does that, he's going to be able to go up the middle the other way with some authority instead of a fly out to left. And he takes it himself for the out. Hunter Renfro at the plate. First pitch doesn't find the zone. Righty to the plate. That's Just missed. Well, he looks more focused at the plate and working the count after that first at bat strikeout. And a pitch. And a foul ball. Makes the count two and one. 
And that one fouled off. Two down, nobody on. Stays alive. And a pitch. And down on strikes he goes. That's the third out. Welcome back. Here's the left fielder, Connor left Joe. Field. Pitch. Connor. And a good eye there. And the right hander deals. Swing and a miss. And one and one. And the righty deals. And one and two. Righty delivers. Swing and a high fly ball out there towards left field. Yelich settles under it and makes the catch. One up, one down. The center fielder, number four. Back to the leadoff Dylan. spot in the Twins lineup. Carlson. Digging in is the switch inning outfielder, Dylan Carlson. 0 for 1. He was robbed of a hit on a diving catch his first time up. The wind of the pitch. Now fly ball to right center. He makes the catch, and there's two down. Now batting, second baseman. And now Yohan Moncada. He reached out a walk his first time. Puts it in the air out towards left center. That is the inning. And welcome back as we go to the top of the fourth. John Carlos Stanton to the plate now. First pitch, not close. John Carlos Stanton, certainly a physical presence. And Chris, one of the more imposing guys at the plate in the entire sport. He's a force, and I think it's scary for pitchers thinking about making a mistake to him because you know you're not going to get that baseball back. He hits the ball so hard, you don't even have to watch him swing. You can just close your eyes and listen and know exactly who it is that hit the ball. That one in for a strike, two and two. Next one misses, and the count's full. The wide to kick the pitch. On the ground to short, dives, but it kicks off his glove. And he beats it. That's a hit. Great try there. Here's Rowdy Telez. Went down on strikes his first time through. And the first pitch misses for ball one. That one pulled foul. Left-hand batter waits. Rolled to short, could be two. Off-balance beat, there's one. To Sano, double play. And now the catcher comes up to him. Omar Narvaez. That one's in there, 0-1. Comes up empty on the swing. 0-2 now. 0-2 now. And that skips into dirt. And that one almost got him. This one lifted in the air. Left field. No trouble here, puts it away for the out. And that's the inning. Back in Minnesota, bottom four. And now for the Twins, Gio Urshela. Line drive to short and caught. Miguel Sano, the next twin up to hit. First pitch, and that's in for a strike. 
Oh, and one now. Next offering misses down and away. One ball, one strike. Here's a one one. Two one. Hard on the ground to first. Knocks it down, but plenty of time to recover, and that's the second out. Well, he's doing a nice job of keeping the ball out of the air. Let's the defense work behind him with another ground ball. Good execution. Now batting Max Kepler. Urias gets under it. Makes the grab, and that'll end the inning. We go to the top of the fifth, and now it's going to be Luis Urias. Pitch misses inside, and it's 1-0. Oh. Swing and a ground ball out to short. Over to first. One away here in the fifth. Well, on the mound, very efficient. Able to produce an outcome, it seems like, within the third or fourth pitch of just about every at bat. Adamas at the plate now. That's ball one. The pitch. So two balls and no strikes. Line drive. That drops in, plays it on a hop. The batter. Well, they call that an advantage count for a reason. You're so much more likely to get something you can handle. Ripped that one down the line and kept it fair. And even when you hit it that far out front, you still have to keep your hands tight to your body so you don't hook around that baseball and put it in foul territory. And that right there was perfect. Juan, the next to hit, takes ball one. And the 1 0. Lifted in the air, right field. Two down. Now batting. The and at first, Tyrone Taylor. Taylor. Up now for the Brewers. Next offering is down low. Ball one. Pickoff throw, and he's back in there. The 1 0. High chopper to third. Urshela picks it up, gathers, and throws to first. And that is that. Leading Back at target field. And now the shortstop, the Wilmer, shortstop. Flores. Wilmer Flores. Wilmer Flores. First pitch, just misses. Kicks and deals. And that's outside. He hasn't wanted to challenge him both of those pitches off the plate away. Don't expect anything down the heart of the plate. You may just have to be patient and take your walk here. The 2-0 is in for a strike. Now, there's a pitch we haven't seen in a while. It's going to be tough on the hitters if he can mix that in whenever he wants. Next offering misses. Full count three and two. And here it comes. Foul ball there. Foul ball. Back to right, Renfro in position, and it's caught for the out. Now batter, the designated hitter. And the batter Miguel. now, Miguel Cabrera, rounded out his first time. And the first offering is not close. And the 1 0. Good eye right there. That's where you want it. It's a good miss. No fight. Fouled off. He was late. Clearly trying to stay back a little bit longer for that changeup as he fouls that fastball back. The pitch. 
And downstairs. Still just the second batter of the inning, and on the mound, he's already thrown 13 pitches. They got him working hard out there. And there's ball four. In the back, the catcher, Gary. Gary Sanchez now. Mickey on the move. Sanchez swings and pummels one. Left field. And forget it. Gary Sanchez hits one out. His 17th of the year. It's 2-2. Now back. Connor Joe, the next twin up to him. He's over one. Next pitch is popped up. Narvaez under this one. He's got it. And there's two down. The center fielder, number four. So the batting order Dylan. turns over. Dylan Carlson, oh, the next twin up to him. And first offering is fouled off. And a pitch. That's down and in. Down. One and two. And down on strikes. That's the inning. Joey Lucchese gets the ball now. 32nd appearance. Well, at this point in the ball game, we're talking about middle innings, and he did a little length out of this arm coming out of the bullpen. We'll see just how many outs he's able to give his skipper. Welcome back. Top six. Here's Yelich at the dish. The pitch. Yelich. Lifted in the air, right center field. Kepler drifts towards it. And out number one on the grab. The right field, number 12. Now, Hunter Renfro. Gotta be careful with this guy. He's got power. He can untie it with one swing. First offering misses the mark. Big lefty turns, kicks, deals. Hit hard. That gets through. Now bad. Not much to this one other than just a willingness to go the other way and put the ball in play. That's a team at bat right there. Nice job of staying back and letting the ball get deep. Here's Stanton now. First pitch doesn't find the zone. The lefty, the 1-0. Stanton, the guy capable of hitting it a long way. Oh, you can tell how comfortable he is. Look at that front foot on the line as he is close to the plate. But he can be very quick to a pitch that is down and in. Lucchese, a move to first. And he's back in easily. At the belt and fire. That's off the mark. Now three and one. And ball four to a board. Well, no, interesting. He went with the off speed and walked the hitter. Man, you got to challenge the guy with the fastball. And now it's Rowdy Telez. And first offering is fouled off. <laughs> He's looking for a ground ball to get a double play and out of this jam. The next pitch misses. Yeah, that's ball two. Tough spot right here. A couple runners on. Two ball count. You can't nibble, but you have to execute and finish your pitch. If you leave something out over the plate, it's going to bring in some runs. And that'll load the bases. Pretty easy walk right there. Last pitch wasn't even much to think about. Next for Milwaukee, Omar Narvaez. First offering, and it just misses. The 1-0. And that one 
wrapped foul. And I think ultimately you want to tie him up, get the ball in on the plate so that he can't get the barrel to it and hit it to the outfield. Swing and a miss. One and two. Meanwhile, this pitch gets away. Nothing happening on the bases, though. The pitch. Swinging a foul back. That's out of play. And a pitch. Fought off foul. Here comes the pitch. Good eye right there. Two walks in the inning already, and he just doesn't seem comfortable out there. Like, he can find the right mechanics and then repeat them. And he deals. Got it! Huge strikeout there. Luis Orias up now for the Brewers. And that's in there for strike one. That's towards center. And that is that. Leading back here at the ballpark, the here is Yohan Moncada. The, the right-hander back to work. Moncada. In the air, left field. What a way. Now batting. The third baseman. Gior Shella steps in. In there for strike one. Kicks and fires. Rolled over to third. Urias to first in time. And a couple of quick outs. Two outs, base is empty. Miguel Sano, the next twin up to him. And first offering is fouled off. That one misses in the dirt. The 1 1. And he flips a breaking ball in there or a changeup. Either one. <laughs> Something off speed. Good arm action on it, whatever it was. Next pitch misses. 2 and 2. Next pitch misses way outside. Fly ball down the line. Renfro. Long run on his horse. Got it. Really had to move for that catch. And that's the third out. And welcome back. Top of inning number seven. Digging in. Willie Adams. First offering misses badly for ball one. And the 1-0. -oh. And a foul ball. The wind of the pitch. Here's a swing and a drive left field, and he knew it. A big blow to the home fans, and that gives them a lead. It's 3-2. Colton Wong, the next to hit. And the first pitch misses for ball one. Oh, he's got to delete it. You give up that leadoff home run, go back to work, focus on this next batter. Next offering is in for a strike. The real threats are coming up, already giving up a home run in this inning. And really have to bear down. Towards first. Sano oh, takes it to the bag. The one away. Here. That ground ball may have him back on track after the homer. And now, Tyrone Taylor. And that one fouled off. The old one. Outside corner. There's the strike. The pitch. 
Ball one there. The one two. The other way, and he beats the shift. Really nice job, a two-strike hitting in that at bat. That was maybe even a little yeah. off the plate, but no problem getting the barrel to it. Man, he does such a nice job. That's what you're supposed to do with the pitch in that location. Hey. Casey checks over to first, and he's back. Now it's Christian Yelich. That one's in there, 0-1. Part of the order coming through now, and with one home run already in this inning, they're definitely looking to do some more damage. Checks over to first, back safely. And the pitch. Next offering is outside. Swing and a miss, and that's strike two. That one misses, and the count is filled up. At this point in the game, you cannot issue free passes. He's going to have to challenge this hitter. Hitter's got to be ready to swing it. To first, maybe a two ball. Off balance feed, there's one. Throw to first, but he beat it. Hunter Renfro up now for the Brewers. One for three. First pitch, and that's in for a strike. Lucchese, a move to first. Yelich back in standing. Yelich off of first with two away. Aye. Next offering is in for a strike. Perhaps not quite ready to hit. First two pitches by him for a couple of strikes. Now back is against the wall. He's going to have to figure something out and figure it out quickly. Got him. Good job at damage control right there. Back in Minnesota, bottom of the seventh, and now for the Twins, Max Kepler. Kepler. First pitch, just misses. And the right-hander deals. And that's outside. 2-0 count to a guy with this much pop at the dish. Better expect him to be turning on something. It's going to either get hit hard to the pull side, or the fans better look out in the stands. Next one misses, and that's ball three. That one misses, so a leadoff walk. Well, you know this guy wants to swing it, but he's showing some good patience in this one. It's the second time he's taken ball four. Chris Mark gets handed the rock out of the pen. And he'll work on holding this lead. So up next for Minnesota, Wilmer Flores. He swings and fouls one off. If you're a base runner, you've got to stay dialed in here. Look for anything in the dirt. Try your best to get into scoring position. And the righty deals. In the dirt. Kepler into scoring position on the wild pitch. And there goes the double play possibility. The next offering misses. It's two and two. That's a really good take. And he hits a ground ball right side. Tosses to first. And one away in the bottom of the seventh. Now battle. And next for Minnesota, Miguel Cabrera. He's over for one. In there, and it's 0-1. And the 0-1. And that one clips the corner. The 0-2. 
Line drive, that's a base hit. In comes the run from third. It's 3-3. Three, three. Well, we're starting over again, all tied up. Off the bat, it was headed now for the gap all the way. And as a hitter, Gary. you love seeing those as you take your first Thank couple of steps out of the box. You know you've got some real estate to run on. What it's else? such a good feeling. Nice liner into the gap right there. The 1-0. And a swing and a miss. One away. Tie game. Go ahead run. Stands at first. Going to count one and two. That's one of those swing now before the pitchers even let go of the baseball. And a swing and a miss. That's out number two. Connor Joe, the next twin up to hit. In there for strike one. Yo one. They tried to get him to chase on a slider down and away. And it's fouled away. And a swing and a miss, and that's that. All set for the start of the inning, and here is Giancarlo Stan. First offering, misses the mark. Next offering is in for a strike. A one one. That one fouled off. Not even close there. Ball two. The wind of the pitch. Foul back our way, and that's out of play. The wind to kick the pitch. Swing and a ball popped up. He gets there to make the play. A nice running grab. And there's one down. Now at the plate, Rowdy Telez. And first offering is fouled off. Left hand hitter waits. Inside, just missed. And a pitch. And that one off the outside edge. And a 2-1 on the way. Swing and a miss as he chases that one darting out of the zone. The pitch. Down and in, moved his feet. Left-hand batter waits. Fouled off again, and it remains three and two. And here it comes. And he walked him. One down, runner at first. Omar Narvaez up now for the Brewers. That one's in there, 0 and 1. Ripped to first, caught. The tag gets him, and it's a double play to end the inning. Back now, new pitcher on the mound as we roll into the bottom of the eighth. Brent Suter. He's pitching on two days rest. Brent Suter. Out of the bottom of the eighth. Play. Now it's the switch hitting outfield. Dylan Carlson. Popped up. Wong sizing this one up. And there's one down. Now batting. The second baseman. Here is Moncada. The switch hitter batting right. 
First pitch doesn't find the zone. Next offering is in for a strike. And a pitch. In the air on the infield, Telez. On the run towards the line. Pulls it in on the run. And a couple of quick outs. The third baseman. Here's Gio Urshela. And the first pitch misses for ball one. And that one handled in plenty of time. The first and the Twins go one, two, three. New inning getting started. And now Luis Urias. Pitch is in there. Strike one. That's ripped into the outfield. No trouble here. Puts it away for the out. And there's one down. Man, if that drops right there, they would have gotten the potential winning run on base, maybe even in the scoring position. But that's just one of those hang with them. First pitch, and that's in for a strike. The big lefty turns, kicks, deals. Strike two. Real ugly 0-1 swing right there. As a pitcher, got to be hunting for that strikeout. Keep him off balance. Send him back to the dugout. Next offering misses. It's a ball and two strikes. Next one in the dirt. The wind of the pitch. Sharp grounder. That's through for a base hit. Up next to the Just a clutch at bat right the there. Big base. time swing when this team really needed it. Pitch was away, and he did exactly what you're supposed to do with it. Drive it the other way. Just go with the pitch. Hit on the ground. Might be two. The throw to second. Double play. And that sends us to the bottom of the ninth. We are tied. Michael Brasso, he's the new shortstop as he comes in as a defensive replacement here. Welcome back, and here's the first baseman, Miguel Sano. Here comes the pitch. And ball one. Next offering is in for a strike. Hammer down the line. Should be extra bases. And that one's going to get into the corner. It's a leadoff double, and the winning run is at second base. Well, that may end up being an at-bat. We go back to later on when this game is over. Punched that one down the line for extra bases, and that was an excellent job going with the pitch on the outside. Got his bat on plane and just drove it. Kepler stands in here, takes ball one low. Next offering is down low. Home plate umpire is trying to tighten things up a little bit. And it's second. Ground ball to the right side. And that's a base hit. Throw comes in, and the winning run stops 90 feet from home. Nobody out. Making a move at first, and pinch running for the Twins, Royce Lewis. So runners at the corners, nobody out. And now for the Twins, Wilmer Flores. First offering, and it just misses. All tied up here in the last half of inning number nine. Hit hard, should be extra bases. Across is the winning run, and the Twins walk it off and win it 4-3.
Well, you come into the ninth inning, it's a tied ball game. No one really wants to play extra, so everyone's looking at how we can get this game over with in regulation. Well, they got the run they needed, put one up, and they put one in the win column.